according to him, the cause of death cannot be determined. Because he gave a lot of reasons. He said, by the time he conducted the test, the body had discomposed. And that it is not possible for them to determine the cause of death. So in summary, he's saying the cause of death cannot be ascertained. And when you say the cause of death cannot be ascertained, it means uh, it is suspicious. It is not clear. No particular reason. But he also went for that to say that uh, it, could be, it may be attributed to reaction to certain drugs administered on him before he died. Again, he then qualified that again to say he does not know whether it is those drugs. Well, uh, it's quite unfortunate, very, very quite unfortunate. Whoever carried out the autopsy of uh, Mubade, I think they need to review that person's certificate. So according to what that lawyer said, he said, the cause of Mubad's death cannot be ascertained. It's not clear. Because at the point of carrying out the autopsy, Mubad body don't already roti. See, Mubad body don't already roti. That's what he means by the composed. Don't already roti. So that is why they cannot ascertain the cause of Mubad's death. But, however, he is suspecting that it was a reaction of a drug ministered to him which kind of quack person be that i'm not talking about the lawyer the lawyer has nothing to do with it all they had this case at the corona inquest yesterday so my question now nigerians are you satisfied you're not dissatisfied with the judgment so far with the autopsy report we waited for almost a year for Octopsy report we waited for almost half a year, more than half a year. Come later, come aside. And the only thing they had to prove to us is that it cannot be ascertained that is suspicious. The reason why we went to do autopsy, they will carry that on autopsy, is because to remove the suspicious part. Doctor, may you go meet. Say, make you remove the suspicious part. Now, then, because they talk, say, the thing they suspicious. <laughs> wow, well, I did this country. Oh. <laughs> oh, and you know, if they say they don't know what it by you, that is called his wagbe. And his wagbe means na spiritual problem. Oh. It means so many other things. For instance, we have done a lot of uh, little research on this particular autopsy. The question I asked was that, can, a, can autopsy be done on a 30 years old corpse? They say yes, an autopsy can be performed on a 30 years old corpse. But it will primarily be limited to examining, examining the skeletal remains and any preserved tissue. Over such a long period, soft tissue will have largely decomposed unless the body was preserved with specific conditions like freeze, mummification or certain barrier environment for slow decay. 
Me you na tell me how body me they bury. Body me they bury me no ba spend five days for that ground. They say it don't decompose. How is that possible? You know the mineral something decompose. That means one don't finish up. Not till remain again. But in that grave, we saw blood. If that boy don't decompose, we for no even see fresh blood. You for the nothing like you for no even even the yes man self. Ah, you know me say we waited for how many years just for you guys to come and tell us to even widen our imagination the more, even complete complicate the issue the more for us. <laughs> If they can still do an autopsy on Pharaoh, Pharaoh, as the Muslim uh, uh, call him, Pharaoh, that died 30,600 years ago, to determine what killed Pharaoh, the why now? If Mummies that we have been seeing or uh, decomposed body. Go on, go on, check this uh, reality TV uh, uh, series or shows about uncovering murder case. Murder case that happened 12 years ago, or even 50 years ago, but the body is still there. Most of the tissue are gone. A hey, mother case of more than a year, and they found a decomposed body that is close to one year old. They can still determine the DNA. They can still determine uh, the lineage of the person. They can still able determine how the person looked like. They can still also determine how the person was struck down. The mobile matter. You are telling us after you now send to the case whether that. Tosi city or Tosi case or what they are calling it, down to abroad. You guys came back to tell us nothing. You guys told us nothing. Abba. So you ah so Diva no show say a puncher. Art no show say it was affected. Lungs, you miss say other five days. Won't finish all those things. Abba. Nigeria matter. Can't that guy mobile they just buy like 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 foul. If you put foul for grand, inside grand, bury foul for inside grand. Eh? Go check and five days later. You go see see further. You go see see here. You go see see some things inside. Human being made they put for inside coffee. Ha. Ah. Ah. He reached five days, made a very uh, mobile. He reached five days, made a go commodity body. Hmm. <laughs> wow. Ibu done at one month. So they are telling us now it cannot be ascertained. <laughs> uh, Nigeria can never cease to amaze me. Ah. This is so disappointing. This is so disappointing. You know, they waited. They waited until no bad matter. Nobody send them again. In fact, nobody even just want to hear it again. Nobody even mobile no able trend again. The guy name no able trend. The autopsy report no able trend. He just when Nigeria is talking about dollar matter, talking about the other issue. Now mobile case be a problem. Oh, it's quite unfortunate. May we not die like foul. <laughs> you understand? The person just mm, you don't buy. It, that's all. Ah, this thing pay me because we were all waiting. We were all waiting for that result. We were all waiting for that result to come out. At least that result will remove any form of suspicion. But the result, eh, for even for that complicated the whole issue <laughs> well uh let me know exactly how you feel 
yesterday we had that corona inquest guess what happened because a lot of things are uh, revealing currently even a prime boy said according to his testimony he said Mumi and Mubad were having issues and he overheard Mubad saying that how can I be the father of of uh, Liam Liam when I, I, I already slept with you once <laughs> That was the testimony, part of the testimony from Pride Boy yesterday. It might have baffled me, it shocked me because the what we know about them was is they have been together for more than 10 years. What we make we know say he did Mubad for 10 years. Right from childhood, you can see the, their picture together, even before Mubad got his contract. Now Pride Boy do automatically to say. Mubad does sleep with uh, me just once. <laughs> you see how complicated the issue is. You don't even know who to point to. Well, it's left for the court now to determine the case. But the way I'm seeing the case, everybody will just go their way. Naramali, all of them will just go their way. Naramali and Samnari have no case to answer at all. The way I'm seeing it, Pride Boy have no case to answer at all. Wumi have no case to answer at all. Mobile Father has no case to answer at all. Nobody get any case to answer at all. The only thing now is uh, Liam's DNA. And according to Wumi's sister, she wrote this. She said, My sincere apologies go to Baba Mubad, Mr. Aloba Joseph. Sorry for everything I might have said or posted on my platform. I wish your family the best and may God grant the disease eternal peace. In as much I don't want to be involved, Baba. Okay. So now it's left for the court to determine what happened to Mubad. So if I may ask the audience, eh? What do you think happened to Mobad? Who my Mobad? Because Octopsy reporter, eh, it be like say which overnight go come out the result of Octopsy. So you can't get confusing. Octopsy report no declare again. For the first time in history, eh? Octopsy report no clear. Hmm? I've never seen where they go do proper Octopsy report. Send a go abroad, say no clear. Octopsy report no clear. Did they do octopsy report for course of two thousand years, one hundred years to determine if na malaria keep person, if na fever, if na chicken pox. But this is our own. At least determine whether na he had fear. Ah, whether na cardiac uh, uh, arrest or any other something. Just determine it. So if people see somebody cannot buy for nothing, if if anybody buy, something must buy, man. Even though a time don't reach, they must determine how it take buy. Maybe not heart stop. Brain dead. Or any of that thing. Stroke. <laughs> but obviously for the First time say no no taking my bad. That means not spiritual. It's a spiritual problem. It's a really spiritual issue. It's a really spiritual issue. <laughs> oh my bad, may your soul continue to rest in peace. Ah, it's not easy. Now a DNA test now call me now. That is it. Now DNA test call me now. If they will go do the DNA test. Now you see. Is is such a sad story. This old Mubad case. It's such a sad one. It's just ah. We have a lot of lesson to learn, and I hope most of you have learned it. If you are becoming successful, you should take control of your life. 
take full control of your life. Realize you are a woman or realize you are a man and take full control of your life and be careful. Be careful. Most of us, we are not careful. Be careful. And don't allow anybody to intimidate you. That is one of the most important uh, lessons to learn from a past life. Don't allow anyone to come in between your happiness, to intimidate you. Don't. And they don't bite through way. Bite through way like a piece of rag. <laughs>